Big Teen Gamer here, and you probably already know what, what this video is, but I still gotta explain it anyway. This is going to be a discussion and thoughts of the newest ZZZ update, which is version 1.1. And I am kind of very excited because we get two new characters to play around with, and well, they look really, really, really cool. And besides, the special program is pretty short, actually. It's only like 15 minutes long. But, um, I guess I can show it to you guys. Uh, let's just bring up the special program and transition. There we go. Alright. So, the special program, um, for version 1.1, um, focuses on PubSec again. Even though we did have a PubSec story on, um, Chapter 2 Interlude. But, um, it's mainly probably going to be focused around Jane Doe. By the way, spoiler alert, if you guys don't know. But I'm pretty sure everyone has already saw the leaks. But, yeah, Jane Doe, Ching Yi, Seth. Yeah. Well, um, time to discuss about, uh, what we have here. So, um, they did show a lot of new stuff here. So, of course, there's the new story. Um, there's a special episode with Jane Doe, which is, uh, pretty nice. Um, there's also other stuff, too, that they've shown. Uh, like, gameplay. Uh, there is Ching Yi right here. I think this is the first character they show. Um, which is Ching Yi. She looks really, really cool. Um, you'll probably see it right there. Look at that gameplay. Holy crap. It looks super, super, super good. Um, makes me want to actually play as her. Uh, and plus she is really good on, um, teams that use, um, PubSec officers. Like Seth or, well, in this case, it's going to be, uh, Shu Yin. Uh, Shu Yin is going to be a really, really, really good partner with, um, uh, Ching Yi. So, yeah, it's, it's really, really good. Um, they also showed over here, we're gonna get a new story, of course. I mean, it's it's gonna be based around PubSec with uh, Jane Doe, most likely. So yeah, it's going to be really, 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 really cool um, to see. Uh, I think they also... Did they show other gameplay too? But I don't... I don't think they did. Oh, they, they did. They showed Jane Doe gameplay. Yes, sir. Um, she looks really, really cool, too. I mean, look at this movement right there. Um, she is... Oh, yeah, I forgot to, to mention all the characters. So, Ching Yi is a electric stun character. So, she can be fit into electric teams like Grace or Anton. Um, Ching Yi's probably going to be their best partner, actually, in that team. Um, besides Reyna. So you can't just do Reyna, Ching Yi, Anton or something like that. Or Grace, Ching Yi, Anton. Um, same thing with, uh, of course, I did uh, say it before, but the pub sec officers. You can do uh, Ching Yi, uh, Shuiyan, and then uh, your final character could just be Nicole. Um, that could be a really great team. Jane Doe's probably the same thing. She's pr she works pretty well with PubSec officers because her alignment is PubSec, even though her uh, faction is unknown. But I'm pretty sure she can um, she can fit with PubSec because um, they fit her in PubSec. So yeah, but uh, well, this video is the Jane Doe gameplay looks ridiculously good. Look at that! Look at her movement. It looks so clean. Look at that. Look at the ultimate. Look at that. That's so, so clean. So yeah, um, as you see there, Anomaly Physical. That is her type right there. So, um, did they show Chingy's? Yeah, uh, there you go. Um, Electric Stun. Um, right there, yeah. Electric Stun, Pub Sec. But for Jane Doe, she doesn't have a alignment, so we don't know yet. Probably they'll reveal it, like, sooner or later. Um, also, in the agent store, you get to um, play as Jane Doe, um, which is pretty nice in the overworld. So that's pretty cool. But um, that means that we can't play as other... Or you can't play as other agents, just Jane Doe in her story, which kind of sucks. But, I mean, I guess we'll, we'll take what we can get, right? So yeah. Um, the next character that they showcased here is Seth Lowell, um, which is Electric Shield. Yes, this is our second shield character in the game. Um, the first one we got was Ben. 
Um, he's pretty good too. He probably will work on electric teams as well, um, as well as uh, pub sec, and works well with uh, Ching Yi, of course. Uh, yeah, this looks. He looks really, really cool too. Um, you're, you're probably going to see his gameplay like right about now, if they do show it at least. Yeah, he looks pretty cool, but he's a shield and baton wielder, which is pretty sick. Um, by the way, the shield transforms. He uses the shield to transform his thing into a weapon. Yeah, look at that. Look at this electric buster sword that he has. Holy crap. He looks pretty cool. I mean, that's his ultimate. Yeah, it looks really, really nice. They didn't... I guess we didn't... I didn't show Chingy's ultimate, huh? Um, I'm pretty sure they're... did they show it in the gameplay? I don't think I don't think they did. I don't think they show it. They showed the gameplay for Shing Yi's ultimate. Oh, they don't. They did. Yeah, look at that. It looks really really cool too. Yeah. Um, all of these characters look really cool. I probably might pull for them, so you might see a, a summoning video in the future, of course. Um, gotta pull for these characters, right? So. It looks like for phase one, right here, we have Ching Yi. So she's going to be the first one to release with her uh, W engine. Um, of course, every single character's W engine is probably going to be really, really, really good. But I'm pretty sure you could just run Battle Pass weapon and you should be fine. Um, for the most part, because their Battle Pass weapon, um, well, at least the uh, new Eridu, um, the new Eridu uh, Battle Pass, uh, fits them well enough, I would say. So, you can just run Battle Pass if you don't want to run, uh, their main W engines. Uh, the second character, of course, Phase 2, is going to be Jane Doe, of course. Um, with her banner and her, uh, of course, her W engine. Uh, so, these two are going to be our main characters for Phase 1, Phase 2. It looks like Seth right here, If as I saw in the preview, he looks like he is in phase two as a uh, raid up, um, a raid up agent. So he's probably going to have like a 50% chance more to pull him, which is nice. I mean, um, if you just want to get Seth and then just dip, then uh, I guess you could just do like one multi or something and then just get Seth and then just get out. But um, he looks pretty nice. I mean, yeah, pretty cool. Um, I'm pretty sure Chingy's event exclusive. I think they show it here. Uh, exclusive. Yeah, she is an exclusive. Uh, I think Jane Doe is also an exclusive. Yeah, she's an exclusive. Um, and then as for Seth, he is, uh, he can be obtained without exclusive. So once his, uh, once Jane Doe's banner ends, he's going to be featured in the normal summoning pool. So even if you don't get it, um, you still, you still can be obtained. Same with this W engine, it doesn't have to be, um, it doesn't have to be through the uh, special uh, W engine uh, thing. So yeah, but right here, I think they just show more gameplay right there. Yeah, um, they showed a new Bang Boo that you can get, which is, um, I think it's his name is North. I'm pretty sure it's an uh, officer, officer key. Okay, well I guess I'm wrong because I, there is a bang boo that looks similar to um, this bang boo called North, but I guess it's not North. It's just uh, an officer bang boo. So uh, yeah, I guess yeah you can't you can just get the officer bang boo as one of your bang boo, but I'm pretty sure. Um, teams right now they favor towards uh, mono typing, so uh, and it's really great in uh, Hollow Zero and Shiyu defense because a lot of enemies in the game aren't weak to multiple types, they're weak to one specific type. So, um, I guess if you really do want to run a all pub sec team, then of course get the officer Bing Boo, but um, I'm pretty sure. Uh, if you want, if you just want to run an electric team, uh, with your, uh, pub sec characters, you could just run Electro Boo, or in this case, uh, Plug Boo. Yeah, it, it really doesn't matter. Um, you could just run the S-Rank Electric Boo as well. 
um, which is really good. So yeah, it really doesn't matter what you run. Um, Bang Boo just enhance, I guess, the team. But um, yeah, it's a pretty good pickup, I guess, if, if you really want to run a just all PubSec team. It looks like we do have right here events right there. So we do have a new Hollow Zero operation, which is nice. We get polychromes, we get um, we get modifiers to uh, basically uh, get more or get more discs, which is pretty nice. Uh, we do love to see that. Um, as you see there, look at that. Inferno recap. Okay, which is nice. Uh, level 60, of course. I mean, these look pretty cool. I mean, it's just new. It's just new content, which is uh, nice. I mean, we need more of those. So, yeah. Um, they also have new events right here. Uh, there's an event uh, called the Golden the Golden Week. It, well, I mean, I guess it, it's just new era news version of Golden Week, I guess. But, yeah, as you see there, um, you just do, like, exploration stuff. And all all that so it's not really I mean it's just a uh, it's just an event I mean you just collect stuff you do different types of mini games right there as you see so yeah um, looks pretty nice uh, yeah it's called Camilla Golden Week and if you do this event you get a free uh, five-star W engine which is pretty nice I'm pretty sure it'll fit on one of these characters so um, be sure to grind that W engine up um, they also have other certain events too. They got they just have a lot of stuff to do here. Um, yeah, as you see there, there's a lot of mini games. Like there's one where you have to literally fix a TV. Uh, pretty nice. Uh, it looks like there's another event here, Daily Life of PubSec Officer. It looks like your typical daily event. I mean, you just answer needs on uh, customers uh, via uh, PubSec. So yeah, as you see there, it's just. Yeah, look at that. It's just um, it's just your typical basic event, really. Um, there's not there's not really that much, huh? Um, I guess the only takeaway from this um event is it really just uh, I guess it's really just the story and the new characters and such. Yeah. So yeah, as you see there, it's just a bunch of uh, random events that we get really nothing that much to uh look at right there but yeah there's another event right here scene one shot one it looks like it's just a movie event right there looks pretty nice <laughs> i mean look at that see um pretty nice uh they also have a new feature we get to take selfies this time instead of just um you know just doing a front facing camera which is cool um, we get to take a bunch of selfies, so pretty nice. Also, new Shiyu defense, new Shiyu defense content, pretty nice for those end game players. Take advantage of those, of course. And of course, just like Star Rail, we have a bunch of rewards right there. Um, we get ten, we get ten film, ten film, ten ten master tapes, which is nice. And we also get 10 Bang Boo Bucks, of course, right there. Uh, Bang or Bupon. So yeah, we get Bupon and we get Master Tapes. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I think that's, that's it for all the... Um... Yeah, that's it for all the content. Yeah, I, I literally said it, it was short. So yeah, of, of course it's going to be short. It's, it's, it's a special program. Um, so... Yeah, that's basically it for uh, Zenless Zone Zero special program. I talked about everything. So, well, all we have to do now is just wait for the update. So, yeah. Well, anyways, if you do, guys, if you guys just enjoyed the video, if you if you guys do enjoy it, um, and if you want to support the channel, be sure to like and subscribe. Uh, any amount of support is greatly appreciated. Uh, it really means a lot to me. Uh, if you do like and subscribe, um, it is greatly appreciated. Thank you guys so much if you do uh, do that. You help fuel my passion for these videos. I couldn't thank you enough. Without you guys, I wouldn't be here. And, well, 
Uh, let me know in the comments down below. I want to make a discussion. What do you think about Zenlu Zone Zero 1.1? You think it's cool? You think it's a little bit underwhelming? Um, what do you look forward to the most? Are you looking forward to Jane Doe? Are you looking forward to Ching Yi or Seth? What do you know in the comments down below? I would really like to see what you guys uh, say. And as always, thank you guys for watching this Endless Zone Zero video. And I'll see you guys in the next, well, ZZZ video.